<laughs> Something funny. <laughs> oh, uh, we were just telling Davis stories. Oh, how fun. <laughs> Davis. Davis. Do you remember that time that you built that tree house when we were kids in my parents' backyard? Oh, it was so incredible. <laughs> Davis built me a tree house, too. He did? Yes, uh, on our honeymoon night. Really? Mm-hmm, in a big tree up in the Boston Common. And the cops didn't stop you hammering away in the middle of Boston Common? Do you remember you used to play a table? Davis? Oh, well, I uh, prefabricated the panels and secured it to the tree with cable suspension. <sighs> Isn't he the greatest? So what line of work are you in, Bernie? I'm retired. Oh, from what? From all the big, hairy bullshit. Davis, do you remember our adventure walks? Uh, oh, oh, yeah. Oh, there was this one time we went looking for a crashed meteor. Son, could we speak uh, to you a second? Well, uh, We've been talking with Mary, and she wants to get back together with Bernie. And your father and I were thinking if they could be close to Gwen. Like we're close to you. Right. Well, I'll, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll build them a cottage across the pond. Davis, oh! did we or did we not adventure walk from Manhattan to Boston? Yes, we did. Satisfied? I never said you didn't. Ha! Huh, like hell. Do you think, for instance, that this boy could have designed a house as creative as this on a corporate kiss-ass committee? All I said was that you and Davis are obviously well-suited for each other. Don't you think I know what that means? I just meant that you're both very creative. Oh, so in other words, we're both liars. I hope you're hearing this. Uh, sweetheart. Don't defend her. Are you listening to what she's saying? I don't hear her saying anything. Exactly. That's exactly the problem. You don't hear and you don't see. Don't you think I know that you're in love with my husband? Do you think I don't know about your sympathy for him, for having married a fruitcake like me? Oh. Well, you had your chance with him. You had it building your damn tree house and on your adventure walks and on the day he offered you this house and you blew it. I'm the one who found him. And I'm the one who knows what he's worth. And you're the goddamn one he wants. <laughs> you're the one he wants. I'm sorry, I, I, I better go after her.